There is now a bigger reward to catch the killer of this 18-year-old Rains High graduate who was shot to death just hours after he walked the stage and got his diploma. His family desperate for answers. The one snatched his life. They literally snatched his life. The reward is now up to $13,000. Today, the family of Rashad Fields held a news conference hoping someone will come forward with information that will solve his murder. Tarek covered that news conference and is joining us with the family's message. Tarek. Well, you know, Rashad Fields' mother says the grief of losing her son is something her family struggles with every single day. The 18 years old, old's life tragically cut short following a major academic achievement. It's the one snatched his life. They literally snatched his life. Backed by extended family and lawyer John Phillips, Rashad Fields' mother, Yvonne, talks about the evening she celebrated a milestone, her son's high school graduation, only to be overshadowed by cold-blooded murder. And that was the last time I seen my child. After he woke, after he woke, that stage at 7 o'clock, he left, and me and my family member was hollering, Rashad, Rashad, 53, 53. Then to get a phone call to tell you that your son is dead. JSO officers say the Reigns High School football standout was on the way to a graduation party when he was shot and killed off of Pine Estates Road on Jacksonville's north side. Field says her son had been recently awarded a full scholarship to Kaiser College in West Palm Beach for football. The family's lawyer saying Field's murderer must be caught before he kills again. This is not just a loss to the Fields family. This is a killer that is out on the streets. This is a killer that, that JSO has indicated may not have even intended to kill Rashad Fields. And so this is a killer that, that is potentially going to kill again. Phillips says the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is processing forensic evidence found at the scene and says JSO is hot on the trail of the killer, but they still need more information to make an arrest. Crime Stoppers is offering a $3,000 reward for information leading to an arrest, and Phillips' law firm announced it's putting up an additional $10,000 in hopes of encouraging someone to come forward. Obviously, school is starting back. We wanted to take this opportunity to say, with school starting back, people are going to be talking. There's going to be more information. So the attorney there, John Phillips, is urging not only students, but also parents as well to offer any information they may have about Rashad Fields' murder. If you know anything, you're asked to call JSO or Crime Stoppers. Tom? Thank you, Tark.